udah jumpet jangan ha I see oh saya berani tak perlu oh 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 okay 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 masih Ah, ya. Yeah. Ah, semua abang suruh ambil sebab dia tak boleh pergi dia baru ni dia uh, positif COVID. So dia suruh saya standby passport. Oh. Ah, okey lah. Ah. Okey, terima kasih. Oh, okey. Come back to the registration department. Because of my change of name. I converted back in 2006. thinking that I was going to get married no? but of course it didn't happen so my name in my IC is different than my birth certificate so different than from my passport so I need a letter Passport certificate, I'm Evelyn Avita. Passport, I'm Evelyn Avita. I see, I'm something else. So, we are one zero three seven. Here in Malaysia, it's very, very difficult once you convert to go back to your original religion. Most lawyers won't even take the case. And those who do, they charge a lot. I've gone years back now to try and find out. own mistake so it's a small price to pay lah. considering what would have happened had I got married to him <sighs> so I had caught him with another woman in my flat. I gone back early. He didn't expect me to go back that early, and I caught them. She was wearing my clothes, sitting on my bed, and I came back to mummy's. Linda, Linda knows all about it. Then I went back, and Linda drove with mommy in the car followed me they were afraid that you know I might 
do something that I regret later. Anyway. The lady at immigration was so nice, she was so happy that I found the passport and she said she had already spoken to her superior about my case and so I was able to just walk in. Then of course came the part about the name and Now we wait. Let's stop this now.